guys, welcome to the channel. I'm Don. This is Rockin' a Country. I'm cracking up because right before I sit down, I take a look at the song that I'm going to react to, and the title is hilarious. Uh, drink that mash and talk that trash. It reminds me of Larry Bird because he's known to be the biggest trash talker in NBA history, which I did not know, even though I was a Celtic fan back then. He just did it so quietly, but all the stories came out later. But this is Lester Flat, and it was requested by Sandra Turner. So, Sandra, shout out to you. Thank you for this request. It may be the first time we've re uh, reacted to Lester. Let me see. Yep, first time I've reacted to Lester. So let's see what we've got going here. Already in a good mood. I remember it was back in the 60s, I think. We had nothing to eat, but there was plenty to drink. The pot took the food stamps down the hill, but he'd trade them off and get sugar for the steel so he could drink that man. And talk that track. Oh, is he talking? Now things are pretty bad, but they could have been worse. Instead of eating gravy, it could have been dirt. Pop would go down to the welfare place. More sugar money was on its way, and he was spending on mash so he could talk that track. Now down in the valley lived old Maggie Hill, just about a mile from Pop Moonshine's Hill. When Mom and I would find ourselves alone, we knew Pop had found old Maggie at home, and they were drinking that man and talking that train. Now Mom knew what was going on, I know, but she wasn't about to let it show. She said, Papa ain't a gonna trouble you. Tomorrow he gets his money from the H-E-W, but yeah, you'll spend it on me so he can talk. Friday night, Mom took the shotgun down. I heard the noise from the valley and looked all around. She took the shotgun. I'm thinking she was going to shoot the still, but she went to town. Oh, Jesus. Is she going to go hold something up to get money to buy food? Hmm. Won't be long till that noise will stop. So the off gun will make crowd out of pop Cause he's a drinking that man <laughs> And talking Shot that train They said pop didn't have the chance of a mouse That gun tore away about half of the house The judge told mom, said it's funny to me They'd bring him into court with such a plea Cause he was drinking that man <laughs> And talking that what was the trash he was talking? Now I find no pop where he's at. He's still a tote of sugar and a getting fat. He just looked over and says, let her burn. While me and old Satan bends another worm. So we can drink that man and talk that trash. So we can drink that man and talk that trash. I don't know what I missed in that song. Like, I mean, she didn't kill him. I thought she went to shoot him, and I think she did. She's in court, and her defense, and that's pretty fun, her defense was he was drinking that mash and talking that trash. I guess for attempted murder, that's not a great defense. And he's not happy with her, so he's like, let her burn. I think that's how, that's how I heard this thing. But... Yeah, I mean, it was open-ended. He was talking that trash. What the trash was, we never did find out. And it's one of those open-ended things where you can just guess. But he was talking trash out there somewhere. I don't know about whom, about what, but maybe just a, a drunk guy being a drunk guy. But he kept taking the family's money to buy sugar so he could keep making this stuff. Now, I don't know about mash. I mean, there's certain things I know about a still when you're making moonshine. But I don't think you call that mash. So what does mash produce when you get the sugar? I mean, maybe it does produce moonshine. He didn't say that in the song. But, yeah, it's like you see about bourbon, like sour mash and all that. I don't know. But, all right. I'm going to rate this song, Sandra. 
unless you say Sandra, but I'll say Sandra, it kind of flows. Gosh, that was a fun ditty of a song. <laughs> I, the number that popped into my head was an 8.8, .8, so that's what I'm going with. It was a fun lyrical song. I love the way he sings. I do. He's just got that country, here's a story, voice and presentation. And the picking was beautiful. It was crisp. And it was just a fun. It's just all about the story. I love seeing new reactors. The reactors who are new to country react to a couple of country songs. And you always hear them say, man, the stories they tell in here. And we're wired for story. We, the human race, are wired for story. We love stories uh, for whatever reason. And in country and in Western and in bluegrass, you get stories. So. There it is, folks. All right. Have a great day. I'll see you on another video. Keep rocking a country.